This cool watch is Casio WV200R with scepter with multiband 5 feature, meaning it can be synchronized to 5 atomic clock transmitters in UK, US, Germany, and 2 transmitters in Japan. But anyway, I live in Indonesia, which is out of the coverage of these transmitters. So in this video, I will use the other way by using the watch manual synchronization feature to get signal from my Android smartphone as a transmitter emulator. And here are some of the emulators in Google Play Store. One of the most popular is Radio Watch Sync. But in this video, I will use the basic one made by MoQ and choose the JJY which will emulate the Japan transmitter. And here's how the app looks like. It will transmit the time here, 10.34 something, to my watch. And sorry that currently the time on my watch is already looks the same. I have just synchronized it yesterday. Okay, now what we need to do is changing the Siri on the watch, since the manual synchronization only active to Siri's with signal coverage. And because the emulator is for Japan, I will choose Tokyo as the Siri. Now exit from the adjust mode and enter to the manual signal receiving by press and hold the receiving button. As shown here, the display now says RC, meaning receiving. Now let's place the smartphone speaker to be as close as possible to the upper top side or 12 o'clock position of the watch. You can use something to prop up the watch and the smartphone. Here we can see that the watch is receiving signal with power up to 3, meaning a strong signal. Anyway, it will help a lot if you do this in silent location to avoid any noise and interference. Now let's wait for the result. After a few minutes, it shows get, and the time is now synchronized to the time on the apps. There are still two things to do now, change the city back and adjust the time difference. Anyway, some other apps might be using the transmitter time automatically, which makes the job easier, meaning you don't need to adjust the time difference, but looks like this app is now using the smartphone time. So first, I will need to change the city back to PKK. And then now, I will adjust the time difference by 2 hours. And that's it, done. I hope this video is useful and have a great day.